$900 reduce. Hey, what's up everyone? It's that time of the month again. Yeah. <laughs> yes. Yes, it is. Got some insane eBay <laughs> uh, retro gaming listings for you. It's my turn now to show Chris the listings and you've got to guess what price they're listed at and right. this sort of higher, lower sort of situation, you get a couple of goes. Can't wait. Yeah, <laughs> you're going to love it. Right, first off, straight up, it's, I can't believe we haven't featured this before. It's our um, mascot. Oh, is it? On eBay. Is it is listing? No, oh. not even. How much do you reckon? <laughs> right. What do you reckon? I, well, based so, on all the other ones, I'm going, let's, I'll start very, very high. Well, all right. Uh, three grand. <laughs> Lower, actually. X, well, right. <laughs> I was, my faith in humanity is starting to be yeah. restored. One grand. Yeah, lower, I'm afraid. One, one, one more try. 500 quid. <laughs> Spot on. Really? <laughs> 500 pounds. Fuck. Got some free postage, or you can slap on a best offer if you want. <laughs> I'll give him a quid. Yeah. Yeah, I mean, I got mine for free, um, but yeah. Oh, 500 quid. Fox, Fox Standy that's, that's behind us in, in just about every video. 500 pounds. Uh, so grab yourself a bargain, mate. <laughs> I will, right. just somewhere else. <laughs> On to the next something one. else. Yeah. On to the next. And um, we have the old Diddy Kong Amiibo in the box. And this one is listed as having a defect, so it's rare oh, AF Christ. according to the listing. 800 quid. Ooh, I might want to go a bit higher than that. <laughs> <laughs> Two grand. Well, I think you should try try higher on your last attempt there. <laughs> Nine grand. You're very close. Oh, I. You're very close. Uh, Ten thousand pounds. Fucking hell! Um, but the stinger is seven pound fifty. <laughs> Where do they get these postage numbers from? They go, oh, well, 10 grand's not quite enough. It doesn't even say get it fast or anything. <laughs> just a regular just amount. Just £7.50. That's just like the small parcel fee. Oh, £7.50. It's, it, it's got a defect where his t-shirt is plain without any stars on it. So it's shit. So it's been painted incorrectly. Um, yeah, so it's actually it's, it's really, really rare, this one. It says rare in capitals on the listing, so yeah, rare. Mm. That, see that? It says that so that idiots will see that and go, oh, we'll give a fuck what the item is. Yeah. It's rare. Don't care about it. Money's no object. No, it's rare. So yeah. It's got a defect. It's one of a kind, really. Um, I've not so seen... I posted this. I wish he was one of a kind. <laughs> I'm sure he is quite special, yeah. I don't know. The fact that we've, we've made a little series on these <laughs> already. I might want to have to check my, uh, my Amiibo collection. I'm sure I've got some defects in there, but... No one's going to give me ten grand for it. I pay. I pay less than retail for it. Yeah, fiver should be paying fiver for amiibos <laughs> nowadays. Yeah, not not the new ones. But oh, that's painful. Any, any older ones. So anyway, <laughs> moving on. Okay, the next segment has been all been um, it's all been contributed by uh, some Twitter followers of ours. Oh, right. So I take, took some screenshots. Couldn't believe my eyes, and I just have to share it with you. Really. So oh, I will say, um, as a little disclaimer, I don't use the our Twitter account, Bender, so I've never seen these you before. Yeah, you won't have seen them, so yes. yeah, I need to put that in. Uh, this one's from Sorak Space. Excellent. Um, fellow minister. Um, let me just get the... So we've got some Sega private number plates. <laughs> really? Um, oh, dearie me. All certificated, all above board, all right? Just... Who's fucking getting those? So there we go. Have a think. I mean, I'll just get a number plate that says prick. Have a good old think, mate. Oh. <laughs> so good. Four grand. Oh, higher. <laughs> <laughs> Better believe it. <laughs> oh my god. Um. Oh. Not doing so well. Got, I think you got one so far. <sighs> Eight grand. Uh, higher. Fifteen grand. Oh, you're on. Oh, shit! <laughs> exactly. Yes! Um, free, collection only. <laughs> it's fucking 
the scrolls from? <laughs> Where does this prick live? Couldn't, can't even be bothered to curry it. <clears throat> It's like the postage is free, mate. I know that because it's collection 15 only. Fifteen grand. Yeah, for a. But, but number plates do go for a lot, though, don't they? Fifteen grand. They don't. It's quite special to have that one. You have to have a number in it. So there's five, and then Ega or Ega if you want to. If you're Brian. Pronounce it properly. Yeah. <laughs> but yeah. So thanks, Sorax. Thanks for that. Um, yeah. I'm gonna have to get my pay, my wallet out. I think. And, uh, well, all right, I'll get mine out and then I'll burn it. <laughs> yeah. Just so yeah. I need to define this. That is that is fucking disgraceful. Right. Why would you type to get that? <laughs> yeah. Oh, I'll find it. So got some Sega other ones. bullshit pricing. <laughs> got. I've got a couple here actually. Um, uh, Digital Doom underscore Wow on Twitter. <laughs> um, Excellent. What we've got here is an instruction book for. Pro Protector for the Sega Mega Drive. Just the instruction book. There it is. So, how much do you reckon? Just that is literally just the instruction. Just book. the instruction That's manual. Christ, no, this isn't very, very good, good Nick. But does it? it looks. It's all right. Looks new. It's one of the. If it came with a box and a game, I'd be interested. Yeah, I'd be well, well interested. Um, oh. Just the instruction manual. Oh, so this is going to be a fucking ridiculous price, isn't it? Because it's just the instruction manual. Why would they charge a reasonable amount? Um, I'll go for I'll go for what I pay first. Right. I'll waste one of my guesses. Okay. Two fifty. Oh, that's two pounds fifty. Uh, uh, higher, yeah. <laughs> it is higher. Of course, it is. <laughs> Seven hundred and fifty quid. Oh no, lower. Three hundred and fifty quid. No, uh, yeah, we're way off, mate. It's actually a uh, hundred pound. Ninety-nine pounds ninety-five. Right. right. That seems reasonable compared to all the other ones because we've done. I, I, I'm, I'm, quite not, anno I'm not annoyed with that. I'm annoyed with me for not being annoyed with that. I'm kind of annoyed because it is quite middle of the road, but it, to me, I'm still disgusted. Oh, that's. I mean, that's a horrendous price to I, charge. How much does the. I didn't look it up, but how much does the complete game go for? <laughs> it depends who's selling it. If it's this prick. Well, yeah, five watches on this, though. It's probably, oh, it's probably it's people probably, on our Twitter feed looking yeah. for <laughs> Or his mates. Yeah. Um, £1.10 economy delivery, so you'll get it uh, for an economy in a, product. In a few days, really. Uh, <sighs> Jesus. Thanks for the contribution there, mate. Yeah, thanks thank a lot. You. So we'll go on to the next one. <laughs> this is from, uh, this is on Twitter again there. This is from uh, Mog Anarchy. Oh, excellent. Let's just find the actual listings. So we've got, um, I can't remember, I have to hide it from you. A PlayStation 2 game, Rule of Rose, factory seal condition. Rule of Rose, heard of that? Rings a bell. Mm. What do you reckon? Factory seal. 400 quid. Oh, higher. <laughs> <laughs> that was deadpan. Uh, 800 yeah. quid. Yeah, higher. Fuck <laughs> <laughs> out! Go on, one more. One thousand one hundred and seventy-four pounds and no. sixteen pence. You've overreached yourself a bit there. Fuck. Eight hundred and forty. I'm not. I've overreached. <laughs> yeah. I'm overreaching, am I? Yeah, you're reaching a bit, mate. Jesus. Um, eight hundred forty-nine pound ninety-nine. Oh, go fuck yourself. Um, or best offer. <laughs> <laughs> um, ten pounds. That's my offer. Yeah. Ten pounds for this. Yeah, you know, vaguely. Rare sealed PlayStation 2 game. Yeah, I'll give you 20 quid if you send me that and just disconnect your internet. Yeah, and can't delete your account. Yeah. Right? All of them. Just yeah. all of your accounts. Go, in fact, just go fucking live under a bridge or something. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Play with traffic. <laughs> Christ. <sighs> so, we've got one from uh, King Monkey 25 Cheers, mate. What a hero. Yeah, and uh, I'll just zoom in slightly and uh, just give you a picture of it. Um, it says, this is, it looks like it's from Gumtree or some other online marketplace. Uh, original SNES and Mega Drive. That's, that's the listing. That's it. And you've got pictures of, of um, the items in question. When, we, when I look deeper into it, there are some games in the listing as well, but wouldn't specify. <laughs> I didn't even say what they were. Yeah, and the first person, <laughs> the username is Lax A, like the name is Lax A, so Lax A. I, yeah. Sense of humour, probably. Penis. 
<laughs> I imagine. I hope that the common a's, sense. Yeah, I hope that the A stands for asshole. <laughs> well, so what do you reckon? What would you? Uh... Well, right. Let's have a think about this objectively. So I. It looks like it's very white uh, Super yeah. Nintendo, but the Mega Drive looks a bit looks a bit grubby. I'd actually pay right, one hundred thirty quid. Yeah. Yeah. Oh. Are they, what? There no boxes or anything? Don't say. Just SNES original right. SNES and Mega Drive. Ninety quid. I'd pay. Oh, yeah, mate. Is it higher? Yeah, it's higher. Of course yeah. it is. Um, so I'm basically I'm just basing this on what I paid for those. Yeah. Those two items there. Um, well, just for a Mega Drive, I'd probably pay twenty pound. Yeah, me. That's that's what I pay. Just for so a Mega Drive Two as well. SNES off you for thirty quid. Yeah, bargain. Yeah. This is a Mega Drive Two as well, which is a, the, it's not as good as the original. Yeah, that's the one I've got. Uh, <laughs> it's more compact, but I prefer the, the look of the original. Mine's really compact, given it's round your house. <laughs> is it? <laughs> yeah. Mega Drive. It's the yeah, it's the one that's on your Mega CD. No, it's not. It's mine. Yeah, it is. Oh. Your Mega Drive is fine because it wouldn't work on the tape. Oh yeah, that's right. <laughs> Yeah, that's a Mega Drive 1. Well, that was almost a scrap. Yeah. Oh, is it a Mega Drive 1? Yeah, yeah, it's a 1. Fucking <laughs> <laughs> hell. Yeah. My memory, my memory. Come on. Uh, right. I'm going to guess he's got left 1. No, 2. Yeah, uh, 400 quid. Oh, lower. Uh, excellent. Yeah. Oh, he's not a complete bastard then. <laughs> um, 250 quid. Oh, almost. Uh, 300 pounds. Oh! So... 300 quid is too much money, mate. It's, it is just too much. Too much money. 300 pounds. Right, Lax A. That's his name. Lax A. Brain, soul, cock, <laughs> reason to live. Right, next up. <laughs> this is from Twitter. Chris P, or his handle is SNRPEDE2010. Oh. Right. Is it Chris P or Crispy? Chris P. As in the, 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 yeah, sorry. Change your name. Yeah. Got um, Realm of Impossibility uh, for the ZX Spectrum, or just for the Spectrum. I know fuck all about Spectrum plugs, but I'm just I, I know well, I know about eBay. Yeah, it, it's the, it's got the cassette and it's like it's got the inlay and uh, the case and the original sticker on the front, promotional about a, a metal badge offer. So. <laughs> What do you mean? Well, you They're offering a metal badge. Includes free enamelled metal badge offer, so you'd send off the badge. <laughs> just the offer for it. Yeah, just the offer for it. Uh, like. SI in friends, that's genuine pterodactyl aim. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Brilliant. Um, do you reckon realm of impossibility? Um, this is a realm of impossibility. I yeah, I was going to say, I imagine the price is. Uh, is yeah, I mean, it, yeah. it evokes that title. It's, uh, um, it's, it's, a, it's a tall order. Two grand. Lower. <laughs> what did you say? <laughs> um, <laughs> it's a definitely lower. Uh, Seven hundred quid. Higher. <laughs> One thousand three hundred. Almost. Oh. Uh, Nine hundred and ninety-six pounds. <laughs> I was fucking nowhere near. <laughs> you said almost to make fun of me. Uh, um, a couple hundred off. And then you know, one pound sixty postage. <laughs> one pound sixty. Um, it says items are graded, much like people do at records. Oh Christ! Right, this at, again. Looking at the picture, mate, it's not graded no. because it's not sealed inside it. Exactly. The video games grading authority. I'm not offering. You send that off, and it gets sent right, back right. to you in the case. This, it gets better. I'm not offering returns due to the products being used condition. Yeah, it's a Spectrum game, mate. Um, <laughs> It's got that brand new. Yeah. And the fact that and the fact the fall rate on them is very low. The fall rate. Is he implying that once he sold it, it's going to plummet in price? Because it was never worth that fucking much to begin with. No, it's not worth that much. So at basically, all. he's he's in his description, the item description. <laughs> he's calling himself out as a wanker. Well, it's the sort of thing you'd probably find in a big bundle of games that you might buy. Which is. Oh, where I'd, I got it from. I'd hazard a guess, yeah, that's how he yeah. happened upon it. So yeah, 996 quid for that Spectrum game, mate. Um, enjoy. <laughs> You'll so. be the only one that does enjoy it, because no one's fucking buying that. <laughs> right, next up we've got um, Shane Battams from Twitter, or his handle would be steady, at Steady Sphere. Oh yeah. Um, yeah, yeah, we've, yeah, we know him, don't we? Yeah. yeah. Um, PlayStation 2, Jack and Daxter, the precursor legacy. UK Powell, new and factory sealed. I mean, 
This isn't a this isn't a game that's hard to come by, is it? Not really. And then, sealed, probably. But so because he's saying it's factory sealed, but um, uh, just as a side note, I love this game. I think it's played it's great. It. Is it good? Yeah, yeah. I'll pick it up then. Probably not for the price we're going <laughs> to discover. Not for this price. Here. It's sealed. <laughs> Go on. <laughs> a grand. Uh, lower. Seven hundred and fifty. Lower. Five hundred. Two hundred and twenty-nine pounds oh, ninety-nine. I'm shit at this game, but Jesus Christ! Free so he's saying that once you open it, it knocks like two hundred and ten <laughs> quid off the price. Yeah. He's a bullshitter. This is fucking. <laughs> this is ridiculous. Thanks for that steady sphere. He's also got a YouTube channel. Um, according to the email sent us, so uh, yeah, I'm gonna put the link for that in the description. Have a look. <laughs> I thought you were gonna say he's also got a YouTube channel that he sent us a link to <laughs> in this message. <laughs> Find it if you want. No, <laughs> that is it. Good <laughs> keep it. Everyone, every, links for everyone in the description. Uh, whatever the whatever the social media uh, platform was. Um, I like that. Yeah, that's good. That's what. That's my little lad. <laughs> oh yeah, um, here's a good lad, Rob Bobble Parker, oh, Derby drinker on, yeah. on Twitter. Um, He's a hero. Got a white PSP console unboxed. <laughs> so it's literally something you can buy and see. And it's look, look at the analog stick there. The thumbstick it's is. It's a bit. I mean, that is rancid. A bit, off, a bit off centre as well. And there's a lot of skin flakes on it. Yeah, loads of skin flakes. I mean, on that there. is clean up your shit before you try and, and sell he's it. He's taken the picture on top of what looks like his laundry as well. Um, <laughs> there's some socks. Is that yeah. socks? <laughs> just for all these people, just as a, like, as, as a heads up, I used to run a business on eBay. You don't post a picture that includes your pants. All right, it's just not. <laughs> Unless the item's pants. Unless it's pants, yeah. And then you shouldn't, never be them. They shouldn't be selling them anyway. Um, it shouldn't be a load of shit in the background. <laughs> yeah, just get a white sheet of paper or something. Like, yeah, if you can't be asked to clean up, just clear a little space. Yeah. Just move some of the, like, like <laughs> the fucking Red Sea, just move bits of it out of the way. Just a sea of old clothes and uh, like crumbs. Just move that yeah. and then put your shit in the middle of it yeah. and take a photo. Easy. It's, Remember, remember this is a visual medium, visual medium. Just remember that. Yeah, yeah just <laughs> Hoover, just one it's, circle. It's not sound. Yeah. It's it's visuals, so you need to. Because oh. I mean, what do the other photos look like? Because that's the best one. You thought this yeah. would do. This is better than all the others. Yeah. What was in the others? Yep, that one's going in. <laughs> I was going to say something. Uh, Steady on there. Yeah. Anyway, uh, just, <laughs> this is what we've got. What you see is what you get, really. Just a, a white PSP console unboxed, and it looks nice and grubby. It's on, on some laundry. It looks like it's on a duvet or something. I don't know. I'm going to go with the real price £30 sterling. Higher. What a prick. Um, <laughs> 200 quid. Higher. Fuck off. What do you mean, higher? It's higher, mate. You've got one more game. <sighs> 350. Ooh. Yeah. <laughs> yes! Or, oh, but. Here's the rub. £9,999,999 postage. What?! <laughs> Why? What the f- It's- yeah, and Diver Drinker goes, I wonder if it's first class delivery by the RAF. It better be, or by fucking Boris Johnson on a zip wire. Yeah. Waving Union Jacks. Yeah. I'd pay that much money to kick him in the bollocks when he, when he touches down. Then take my PSP. Who's delivering it? We're knowing a rider. <laughs> you know? <laughs> She'd steal it. <laughs> yeah, sure. <laughs> She'd. No, like smoke without fire. No, no, she, no, she's no. nicking it. Yeah, CCTV that is tells her. Absolutely all. disgraceful. I mean, 100% positive feedback, so. Um, yeah. <laughs> so he's bought one thing. Uh, the <laughs> estimated delivery, five days. What? I should think it would be almost instantaneous should based be, on that postage price. Yeah, it should be within a few minutes, really. I mean, come on. Uh, this, right. This makes this actually makes me sad. <laughs> Does it? Yeah. This is this is really difficult to do. <laughs> Got another. <laughs> Got this is from Scaredy Matt. All right, Scaredy Matt. Thanks for this one. Um, Cheers. We got Soft porn adventure. <laughs> How much? No, Un no price is too much. Online system, Sierra, uh, Atari, and various <laughs> other keywords he's put in there. So soft porn adventure. What the um, fuck was that? Is that what it's called? Yeah. <laughs> that's the name of the title. Yeah, that's, that's the, the name, genre. That's the name of the game. Oh Jesus! 
So <laughs> <laughs> Oh Christ. It's in Euros, so if you wanna just try it in Euros just uh, It's essentially the pound now anyway. Yeah. Um will be for a while. Yeah. <laughs> Before it overtakes the pound. Yeah. <laughs> um Eight hundred euro. <laughs> More. Oh, <yeah. laughs> it's not even. It's soft porn. What do you see? Like a flash of side tip. It says for adults only. Does it on the front? Yeah, I don't know. Um, um but yeah. two grand. Hang on. Oh, lower. Oh. <laughs> one thousand seven hundred. Oh, nearly. Got one thousand four hundred. Oh, I was going to go one thousand five hundred, and I didn't. No, uh, which is. <laughs> Which at the time of posting is approximately one thousand three hundred and fifteen pounds and seventy seven pence. Not including postage, mind. How much is postage? Sixteen pound forty one. <laughs> so I don't know I don't know where it's based. Um, <laughs> um, I couldn't see the, the country of origin, but thirty day returns, hundred percent positive feedback, why not? Just take take the plunge. Because it's mate. shit. Just take the plunge. <laughs> Soft porn adventure. Yeah. So next up. What have we got? I'll tell you what I've got. What? Well, Twitch. <laughs> Twitch in your eyeballs. Yeah. yeah. Right. Last one. This is. This has been. <laughs> yeah, this has been um, donated by. I'll be back is their username. Excellent. Um, but the actual handle is the Gabriel Sin on Twitter. Don't know what that means. Um, so we've got. <laughs> <laughs> no. It's a lovely handle. This is, this is a game I'm kind of sick of hearing about, um, to be honest, in, in the whole retro gaming community. But it's always there and we'll never get, people just won't seem to get over it. Conquer's Bad Fur Day. I love that game. For the Nintendo 64. Oh, and look what it's in. It's in one of, the, one of those boxes. Yeah, and it's, and it's people that fucking just pluck a number out of their arse. It's, it's in one of those plastic sort of VGA grading boxes which mean absolutely nothing at all. Yeah. You know, they start at, so I was looking into this because they yeah. pissed me off, they start at 70. That's their lowest rating. 60, uh, 70, 80, 85. Completely meaningless. Yeah, yeah, complete uh, con. This is something that you, you don't need. They're a subsidiary of the Action Figure Grading Authority. Are they? Yeah, if you were interested. Right. And also, you can buy your own cases. You can uh, just buy them from the website. Oh, good, yeah. I'm so that could be horseshit. What I have not found out, though, is that they don't... They, they value it, but they don't tell you... They aren't telling these people to fucking put them on the eBay for nineteen million dollars. Well I would hope not, yeah. Yeah. But anyway. Still you need to be stopped. Archival graded, VGA, uh, blah blah blah, meaningless, 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 babble babble. Conquers bad fur day, uh, for the N64's PAL version, it's not sealed. Um, but what do you reckon? Well I've got an unboxed copy of this that I bought yeah. in Brighton for like twenty quid. Right, that's not um, bad. Um, there's loads of these around this, yeah. this game, I don't um, know why it's, yeah, it's, it's not rare, a I don't know. Yeah, and there's about, there's like two or three different remakes of it as well, or perhaps I'm exaggerating, perhaps it's just one, but... I think they must have done at least one. Yeah, it's for Xbox 360, really? yeah. So what do you reckon? Uh, I don't I mean, this is going to, this is going to be a fucking aneurysm. <laughs> um, uh, two grand. Actually lower. Jeez. <laughs> Believe it or not. One still grand. But higher. Right, so now <laughs> I've narrowed that down. Uh, yeah. <laughs> um, <laughs> oh, God. 1,250. Oh, quite close. 1,399 pounds, 99 pence. <laughs> I was never going to get that. <laughs> well, yeah. Got three pound 49 postage. Jeez. By the way, that won't cover the insurance to send this, so don't know what you're playing at really. Well, you, I'll tell you what. Just won't cover it. Um, won't cover a special The message to the seller, you could fucking just take some of the money out of that. Yeah. Like 1,400 quid, just take a bit out of that. Maybe just not charge postage at all and exactly. just take a hit. Because it's not fucking worth that. <laughs> no, it's not. Even, even with a little shitty I'm plastic I'm telling box. you it is not worth this Christ. much money. It's just not worth that much. Um, so yeah, <laughs> lesson learned everyone. Oh, I wish I was dead. Don't use eBay as a, as a, as a valuation <sighs> tool because that's what it's not. Thanks to everyone who contributed. We're going to sign off now because I think yeah. Chris is going to have an aneurysm. Um, um, I'm going to... Uh, <laughs> got all the links to um, the relevant um, relevant social media handles to everyone who, um, who contributed and was picked to be in. 
thanks for that. Everyone who did this to me. Yeah, <laughs> so, so check out all those links, um, have a look, have a watch, have a follow, and uh, enjoy. Yeah. See you later. Oh, that was fucking dreadful.